think I figured something out. I think in this time, men get off on the fact that they had a kid with a good woman, like a really good woman. Like there's such a ancient person, possibly, possibly, not all of them, but the real ancient ones. They're such an ancient person that they get off on the fact that they got somebody that has some, so much like class to themselves, so really good morals to themselves. They're good at taking care of and all these things. And I think with women, we get off on the fact that we know the person ain't shit. We know that behind closed doors, but we get off on the fact that they look really good. We probably ain't never had one that looked like that. That looks... That is some eye candy on the arm right there. That is beautiful. But on the inside, at the house, we going through some bullshit. And we know we are. And we choose to keep doing it. Yes. And the person might not be an ancient person. Like they might be, they might have ancient qualities when it comes to what women accept. They might have ancient qualities, but the fact that we see the potential because we are wired to see the potential in everybody and every being, we still have to understand that it ain't all good up in there. It just ain't. Just like a snake. You know what a snake is capable of, but no matter how much you domesticate it, it's still a snake. It'll still fluff up if it needs you. (laughs) If it feel like it. So... And like I said, even with the men, it's like, I can't even say that they, they don't accept ancient parts because if something is not to their liking or something is too difficult, they move on. They don't have the fight in them. They don't have that type of fight in them. It's just, oh no, this is too hard. I can't do this um, next. Or I'll deal with you because of the qualities that you have as a good woman. You look good. You got good qualities. But I'm still going to go over here and do whatever whoop de whoop with such and such. You want that one? Okay. So, hmm. 